configure IPAM on the FortiGate device. Posted on September 14, 2023 by Dideo. From version 40 OS 7.4 features IPAM, IP address management, already available on FortiGate firewall appliances. A FortiGate standalone, or a fabric root in the security fabric, can act as an IPAM server. Interfaces configured for automatic management using IPAM will receive a word address address slash subnet pool of IPAM server. DHCP server is automatically enabled in the GUI, and the address space is allocated using IPAM. Users can change the subnet address range and the size of the subnet that the interface can request. IPAM can be configured on the GUI interface, network IPAM use items IPAM settings, IPAM rules and IPAM interfaces. To configure IPAM components in CLI, Config system IPAM set pool subnet forward slash forward slash set IPAM pool subnet network class A or B set status enable disable forward slash forward slash enable slash disable IP address management services config pools forward slash forward slash set subnet for IP pool edit set subnet next end config rules forward slash forward slash set device interface and IP pool for IPAM rules edit set device asterisk set interface asterisk set pool next end end in previous 40 os versions the set for tipam integration configured below command line config system global the following options are available to set the subnet size config system interface set manage subnetwork size 32 64 128 256 512 1024, 2048, 4096, 8192, 16384, 32768, 65536, end. Demo configuration. In this article, FGT underscore AA is one security fabric route with IPAM enabled. FGT underscore BB and FGT underscore CC are two underlying devices in Fabric and get IPAM information from FGT underscore AA. Fabric interface across FortiGate is port 2. FGT underscore AA acts as the DHCP server, and FGT underscore BB acts as the DHCP client. To configure IPAM within a security fabric, 1. On route 40 gate, Go to the path network interfaces and configuration on port 3. 2. In section addressing mode, select auto managed by IPAM. DHCP server is automatically turned on. 3. In this example, IPAM is not yet enabled. Click enable IPAM. 1. Table subnets managed by IPAM open up. 4. Select Enable Input Pool Subnets, only Class A and B networks are allowed, and click OK. The FortiGate route now becomes the IPAM server in the security fabric. The above configuration is done in the CLI interface. Config System Interface Edit Port 3 Set VDOM Root Set IP 172.31.0.1255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255.255
login to FGT underscore CC and put addressing mode belong to port 34 while auto-managed by IPAM. The subnet selected from the root pool is 172.31.3.1 slash 24. Any interface on downstream 40 gate can be managed by IPAM server. The interface is not directly connected to the fabric root 40 gate. To change settings for IPAM subnet, 1. Enter network IPAM IPAM settings. 2. Change pool subnet if necessary. 3. Click OK. On devices downstream 40 gate, settings on the page network IPAM IPAM settings cannot be changed if IPAM has been enabled on the 40 gate route. Go to network IPAM IPAM interfaces to view distributed subnets, port 34, port 3 and port 3, and DHCP lease information. On FGT underscore BB, port 3 is a DHCP client and the DHCP server interface, FGT underscore AA port 3, is managed by IPAM, so it is shown in the manually configured section. Signs of IPAM conflicts Part IPAM interface shows signs of conflict when IP pool slash IP address overlaps with manually configured IP addresses. Admin can use the table edit interface to manually resolve this conflict. 1. Enter network IPAM IPAM interfaces. 2. Hover the mouse pointer over the conflict indicator. Conflicting information will be displayed. 3. Click edit interface. Board edit interface open. 4. Enter the new IP address in Netmask in the box IP slash Netmask. 5. Click OK. A confirmation message appears. 6. Click OK. Fix bugs on CLI. Use the command in the 40 gate CLI interface to view IPAM diagnostics. To see the largest possible subnet size. Hashtag diagnose sys IPAM largest available subnet largest available subnet is a slash 17. To check the distributed IPAM information. Hashtag diagnose sys IPAM dump IPAM's entries. IPAM entries, SN, VDOM, interface, subnet slash mask, flag. F140 EP4 Q170000000 root port 34172.31.2.1 slash 240FG5 H1 E5 8189000001 root port 3172.31.0.1 slash 240FG5 H1 E5 8189000002 root port 4172.31.0. 1.1 slash 240FG5 H1 E5 8189000003 root port 3172.31.0.2 slash 241. To check available subnets. Subnets. Hashtag diagnosis IPAM dump IPAM's free subnets. IPAM free subnets, subnet slash mask, 172.31.3.0 slash 2417231.4.0 slash 2217231.8.0 slash 2117231.16.0 slash 2172.31.32.0 slash 1917.31.64.0 slash 1817.31.128. 0 slash 17. To remove devices from IPAM in security fabric. Hashtag diagnosis IPAM delete device from IPAMs F140 EP4Q170000000 successfully removed device F140 EP4Q170000 from IPAM.